Well, David, I've been around you uh, a lot, quite a few times over the last couple of years. And there's one thing that uh, has always drawn me to you, David, and that is I know that you sincerely are interested in making a difference and making an impact. Yes, I care about that 100%. This has become a burden and passion project for me. Like this is my mission. I feel like this is my burden and responsibility to be the, you know, to be the advocate for real estate investors and entrepreneurs to say, you can make the money, but please, for the love of God, keep the money too. Like, please, you are working too hard. You traded in your 40 hour work week for an 80 hour work week, you know, for yourself, make sure you have that bottom line. So yes, I want to advocate. I want to help people. I want to make a huge impact. And just getting this book to be able to just give you some concepts that you might be able to take back and implement right away to say, I can do this. Like if I've done my first deal or a thousand deals, like I need this system to make sure that I have what I need going forward. Awesome. What final thought or thoughts would you like to share with our listeners? It probably right then is what I was saying right there. It doesn't matter if you're doing your first deal or your thousandth deal, get this system in place. I have interviewed someone on my podcast, a Profit First REI podcast, where he said, if I would have started this, like when I first started investing, I'd have $5 million more in my account right now. So that lit a fire under me to tell you, if you're starting today, don't miss out on $5 million five, 10 years from now that could be sitting in your bank account. But if you're also doing a thousand deals, then like, you know, or doing a huge number of deals, start this system now. There's so many people that we work with on a high level that always say, man, I wish I would have had this sooner. I probably could be retired by now. So it's like getting it in there. So if I had one last piece of advice, doesn't matter who you are, what level, open one bank account, open it, call it profit and transfer 1% and get in the habit of becoming a profitable business owner and company. That's awesome. Now make sure everybody understands 1% of what? Your income. Anything that comes in that's income. I'm not talking about if you get money from a private lender, you know, like don't yeah, that's take like, their money. That's what you call yeah. balance sheet money. Balance exactly. Sheet money. The balance sheet money. We're talking about income. You sell a house or rental income or whatnot, take 1% of that, stuff it into profit and get into that habit until you fully adopt the system. Now, when do I get to touch my profit account? <laughs> we say quarterly because yearly is too long, not enough of an incentive, biannual is too long, monthly is too much because that way, if you have up and down months, take profit on a quarterly basis so that way that's an incentive. Every 90 days, have a good cycle, do that and take up to 50% out of that account for whatever the heck you want. Take a two week road trip. One guy that we worked with this last quarter took out $50,000, moved to another country with his family. You know, like they're just doing crazy things, whatever you want from your business. That's awesome. Well, David, tell.